This is Twit. So the folks who do uh, Fantastical, uh, which is a great app on uh, on the Mac and on on uh, iOS too, I've used that uh, for a while. It's a it's I, it's my actually my preferred uh, calendar uh, app. I really like it a lot. Um, they're called FlexiBits, and they have now released another app that they made originally for the Mac called Card Hop for iOS. So I use on the Mac religiously Card Hop and FlexiBits. Card Hop has a lot of nice features. It allows you to quickly enter in um, a, a contact list, allows you to find them. It works with uh, Siri Actions. In fact, it has a lot of actions, uh, a ton of them. It's a very smart contact list. Uh, now, it's not free, but it is on sale right now because they only recently released it. So I'm recommending that people check out uh, Card Hub. Actually, um, I don't have my contacts in here because I don't want you to steal them. Mm -hmm. And I know Megan, mm -hmm. as soon as she sees Steve Martin's phone number, is going to call exactly. him. So no contacts. But I do, I do want to recommend this. You know, a contact list. You kind of know how a contact list works. I think the reason I'm glad Card Hop is now on iOS is because a, I like how elegant FlexiBix software looks. They really have a great design uh, feature, and as you can see in this video we're showing, it really is pretty. It's very functional. Look at that. Did you see that little yeah. uh, QR code? So. It, you can share your business card and have a QR code that somebody can scan in. Oh. So there's a lot of really nice, very thoughtful features. Apple's Contacts app is basic, as, a, as all are all the apps. And for a long time, I, and I've recommended it before, I've been using a paid app, but it's expensive. I think it's like 50 bucks a year called Full Contact mm -hmm. because I could scan business cards and it would be hand transcribed into Full Contact. That's a nice feature. But Card Hop is really, really great. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to recommend it. Uh, to people take a look at it uh, it is it is easy to use it's enjoyable it's friendly and right now just four dollars which is uh, almost half off so i think if you if you're already a fantastic cal user you'll know flexi bits and you'll know how easy they make all of the actually how easy it is to uh, it's got auto sense so you just paste in an address and it will automatically put it all in the right fields it has lots of series shortcuts it's I think the main reason to get this is if you use is if you use shortcuts, you can really use it. And I happen to like the dark mode. I'm a dark mode kind of guy. Mm -hmm. I think it matches my personality. So, and it works with Mac. I just downloaded it. Yeah, I'm I, very excited. It's a it's a really pretty easy to use uh, app. And see, go go a little bit more, Kevin, on the video. Go down a little bit more because the the. Uh, uh, the business card feature, we mentioned it briefly. I just want to point that out. It creates a business card for you with a QR code that then you could show another card hop user and they could easily get all your details. In oh, very they fast. have to be a card hop user. Um, I, that's actually a good question. I don't know. Well, I'll try. Uh, all the data is in it. Uh, so maybe maybe they don't have to be. Maybe it would go into Apple's contacts too. I would hope so because that's sort of awkward where you're like, you know, can I have your phone number? Yeah, it's really a nice way to share. Yeah, and and uh, and you don't have to print out paper business cards. And mm -hmm. I, you know, when, when people give me a business card these days, I say, okay, let me take a picture of it here. You can have it back. Yeah. I don't want to waste the money or the paper. Right. Uh, and once I get the picture, that I don't need the business. card. I don't want the business card. Mm -hmm. I want to have. I want your contact. I don't right. want the business card. Card hop. Thank you, FlexiBits, for great work.